I'm making now does not feed my family or myself. Why can't you pay your workers enough so they can pay their rent and pay for food and school clothes for the kids at least? I want to make enough money to support my family. When I had two jobs, my um, hours here got cut because I got a second job and I don't think that's right. And now that I'm not no longer working that second job, they want to try to give me more hours. Even the hours they're giving me is still not making enough money to pay my rent or to pay my bills. support my, my sister Erica you know she works here she works hard you know and and what they pay in her hourly she barely makes barely makes ends meet she's always struggling and struggling you know one practically living from one paycheck to another paycheck you know and she works long hours and everything you know so I, it's good that this is that this is taking place mm -hmm. because you know they deserve they deserve a, a decent pay you know they do deserve it they work hard you know they, they they feed the community they serve them with a smile so you know basically that's that's why i support it you know i i see what my sister erica goes through every day you know struggling to pay her rent make ends meet you know and basically that's it You been working there for six years. And how much do you make? I make eight fifty. And how many raises have you had? Just one, maybe two. And what 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 is your job there? What are the conditions like? I'm a um, crew leader there. Crew leader? Yeah. So what does that mean? Um, well, I lead the crew, like somewhat like a manager. Okay. Where um, I don't really handle money, but I do. I'm not supposed to, but I do. So I um, um, what else I do? I do everything. I know how to do everything. In this way. I bust my butt for what I don't do, for what I don't get paid for. I feel like I do be, um, be degraded. Cause I feel like if they value me, they will pay me for what they, what they, what I'm worth. I work at this Women's on 1175 East Ridge. I'm actually the opening, the opening employee. I have to. Basically pull weeds, water the flowers, scrub the concrete, clean up the trash that people leave. They don't allow us to have uh, garbage cans at this, this windy. So every morning I gotta bust my eyes, clean up the trash, come back in and finish my job that I gotta do inside. It's changing grease, hot grease, chicken grease, scrubbing floors in the inside, wiping down walls and everything. And I feel like that's not enough, that's not enough pay of minimum wage when I'm doing more than the bare minimum. So I think that we should go for 10 for 15. We also got people that they let us off because they're talking about their laborers, not worrying about that we got kids. I pay child support for two kids and I have a, a young daughter that I have to take care of and $8 is not enough to pay bills and take care of three kids. Shake it, yeah, we agitate it, yeah, we bump and break it, yeah, we finna take it, hey now we gon' work it, yeah, we jam the circuit, yeah. Hi, my name is Laverne Gamble. Yeah. Hey. Turn up, turn up. Hey, you know what I'm talking about? I've been working for Winnie for 17 years. Oh. All right? Woo. Now, I've been working there that long, and I only make $10 an hour. Wow. Y'all yeah. I know. But, I gotta work. So, I'm glad everybody's out here. I'm glad Kim came and got me and told me about this. I'm glad to be here. Yeah. And I'm glad everybody's here, and thank everybody for coming. But also, I want to say, it's the same that we got to work like this. But this low pay. Yeah, right. So I'm glad we all came, but thank you, and I'm having a great time. Right for 15, pretty much. We want to fight for 15, and 15 in particular, because that amount will allow us to not only pay our rent, but to pay our bills and not have to decide which one to pay. I'm tired of going week by week, deciding whether I should put a little money towards the rent or be able to pay my phone bill, put extra food on the table, and to make sure my, um, nep my nieces and nephews have the right clothes to go to school. I want fair pay for a fair day of work. I pray that they raise the minimum wage because I would love to see a smile in my sister's face, Erica. We've been activists since 1942. Wow. Uh, we were married in 42 and at that point in our lives Henrietta said to me unless you're going to be an activist I really don't want to marry you. <laughs> and you know what? She changed my whole life. 
We've been activists ever since. Fight for 15 mm -hmm. makes so much sense for people who are just getting by or not even getting by on a very limited income. Mm -hmm. And when you see the 1% in our country who are talking in terms of billions, this morning's paper had a point about uh, Bloomberg having 36 point something billion dollars mm -hmm. to deal with. There shouldn't be that kind of, uh, you know, difference in people's salaries that some people can't even get by and other people have so much money they can't possibly spend it or enjoy it or anything else. I mean, why, do, why don't we equalize the system? We're saying you can't depress wages and have a just society. You have to have a just society where wages are good enough to have a fair living. Mm -hmm. This is a higher pay and more respect from my managers, more respect. That's what's the bug going around and we're gonna get fired, but really, I don't really care. Man, I wish that this strike opened the eyes of the, uh, the bosses here, the, the union reps, and then hopefully we can get this, this raise because we do it, us as fast workers, we're doing more we're doing more than somebody that actually works in the job of customer service. We're customer service, we're quality. What I just told you, I do landscaping. Yeah. A landscaper starts off at $15 an hour by himself, just yeah. doing that solely. I'm doing landscaping, customer service, and food. And each of those jobs are getting paid more than what I'm getting paid here. I'm doing triple, triple the work. I worked at Sutherland and I made $9.85 for sitting down answering the phone. So why can't I get $10, $15 for busting my ass every day? We work hard to, to pay to pay their bills out in Gates, Pittsburgh, Brighton, and I'm here in, living on Clinton Avenue next to drug addicts and, and people shooting and selling drugs, and I got a daughter and, and two sons to raise. And they're out in a peaceful neighborhood, dogs, birds chirping, and I'm out here struggling and paying, pay, helping them pay their bills, and I need my bills paid too. Raise the wage, fight for 15. All right. Just raise our pay. Fight for 15. Gotta go get it. Yeah, we agitated, yeah, we both.